guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing another what I eat in a day, but I'm going to try to add a little more of like a vloggy type of thing into it so show you what I'm more so doing throughout the day. Um, so I already started off my morning with, I did 18 ounces of celery juice this morning. Um, I usually use an entire head of lettuce, like a whole bunch of lettuce, and however much juice that makes, that's how much I have. Um, I used to do half, but it would only make me like 13 ounces, like on a good day. So I decided to up it to a whole bunch. So yeah, um, which is still very inexpensive to do. Like you would think that it'd be expensive, but a whole bunch of celery, like I pay less than $2 for a bunch. So that's like less than $2 per celery juice. And if you were to go out to like a juice bar, you'd pay like $8 for like 20 ounces so I like doing that drinking coffee now that is the next step um, and I wanted to talk about this I have been trying this out okay so this is the chaga or force I'm a little doozy today doozy is that even a word I'm a little off my mind today um, this is the Four Sigmatic Mushroom Coffee Mix, and this is the Create with Lion's Mane and Chaga. And so, like, one of these packets is, you're supposed to mix it into seven fluid ounces of water, and, um, have, like, one packet through day. Per day. I can't talk. I don't know what's happening. I feel very weird. The energy recently is just, like, so off. Uh, Venus is going into retrograde tomorrow. It's like in its intense shadow period right now since it's the fourth today and I am just so You know like I if you didn't know I'm a Libra like hello and um, Venus is my 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 sun sign like ruler so it's a big deal in my life and it's just like I feel very off with it all of this stuff happening um and like I'm, my birthday's coming up I'm super excited I'm super nervous about it I don't know it's just like I'm very off feeling recently but anyways I am not the biggest fan of this I don't think it tastes good I don't really like it too much I also don't mix it with seven fluid ounces of water I did that once and I just wasn't a fan of it I mixed in with my um silk almond creamer and um just not a fan. I don't know. I don't like the taste itself. I haven't seen that big of a difference. I've already, I only have two packets left and it comes with 10. So I've already had eight of them. Um, and I just, I don't see a difference with me personally, with my health, with how I'm feeling, with my, you know, my mind. I don't, I don't, I don't see a difference. So I don't know if I would really invest in these, but if you are interested in trying them, go right ahead. Um, they say that it's healthier than like traditional coffee it has coffee in it it has organic instant coffee powder organic lion's mane ex extract organic lion or ch chaga extract and organic rhodiola rosea extract wild crafted so it has coffee in it it's not like a mushroom you know what i mean so um i don't know i'm i not a fan. Um, skin update. As you can probably tell, my skin is doing a lot better. Um, I have like a couple little breakouts, but nothing is as severe as it was. Um, everything is pretty much healing, which is great because my birthday is in exactly two weeks from today, October 4th. My birthday is October 18th. Your girl is finally turning 21. It is just about one o'clock. Still have not left the house, but I am a little bit hungry and I need to run some errands later. By the way, I tinted my eyebrows, so if they look darker than they did in the last clip, that's why. I do tint my eyebrows because I just find that it makes my life so much easier and I feel a lot better with them tinted because I have like a lot of, I have very light hair like on my eyebrows for some reason. It's like very light. It's like you know, when you're washing your face, you are, like, bleaching. Whatever. Not important. I tint my eyebrows. But I have to do some errands later. I have to go to the... St I don't actually... All I have to do is get my emissions test done on my car, which I really don't want to do. That makes me so uncomfortable. I don't know why. I don't know how to explain it. But if you can relate, anything to do with, like, getting my car service stresses me out a lot. 
I decided to make myself some food, some food because I am hungry. I'm probably going to leave in a little bit to go do that and then I'll head to the gym. Today is back day, so I'm going to do my back today. Obviously, logic. Um, but I made myself a sandwich. It's like a BLT, uh, a vegan one. So I've been super into the light life smoky tempeh like bacon strips. So I have about four of them on here right now because I had only four left and usually I'll use three. But I don't know what I did to only use two last time. So I had an uneven amount so I wasn't just going to leave one. So I have an extra one in here. Usually I use three. This is the Trader Joe's sourdough bread. I have a um, half of a little baby avocado on either on each slice. Um, some romaine lettuce, some tomatoes, some sprouts, and it's phenomenal. Like, this is honestly, my mouth is watering. It's literally, that's so freaking good. Is it gonna focus? Oh, yes, baby. Anyways, um, I'm gonna go ahead and eat this because I'm hungry. This tempeh stuff is so good. Like, it tastes so much like bacon. It's ridiculous. And I also cut it on an angle so it's easier for me to eat. <laughs> mm. It's just so satisfying. 10 out of 10 would recommend trying this out. It tastes so much like bacon. It's obviously not bacon. So there's like some differences. But it tastes so much. It's, it's just so good, you know. Ugh, but it's falling apart. <laughs> Go back in. Go in. I'm going to eat this. And I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. By the way, when I like vlog not at home, it's going to be on my phone. Because I'm not going to bring this huge camera. Because it's literally like... Hold on. It's like one of these. If it'll focus. It's like a huge DSLR. Like, that's what I use. If you're wondering. So I'm not going to take this with me. Because it's heavy and it'll be like this the whole time. You know? In my car, I'm leaving right now. Um, I am on my way to get my emissions test done and go to the gym. I think I'm actually going to go to the gym first. I finished my workout it was a decent one wasn't the greatest but it was okay um, I went to Starbucks which I actually haven't been to Starbucks in exactly a month today so we got a passion tea lemonade sweetened it's delicious and now I'm on the hunt for this stupid place that my mom told me to go to to get my emissions test done and it's in like the ghettoest of the ghetto and I'm so uncomfortable oh shit I'm in the wrong fucking lane um, well I just went the wrong way now you can go it's a red light I'm so uncomfortable. Yeah. If it's not on this road, I'm literally not going to be driving around looking for it. I'm just going to go home. Like, what the fuck is this truck doing? That's definitely not legal. There's no way I can get around this car right now. There's like a huge truck just like stopped in my lane. Can you go faster so that I can go around? Oh my god, can I fucking fit? That's just annoying. You're annoying. Like, come on. I know where I'm going. I just don't know how to get there. 
So I'm back home using the phone for the rest of today's vlog. So sorry about the quality change. But I didn't end up finding the place. I literally drove around that town for over an hour and a half. Could not find it. Did not know the name of it. Did not know what to Google to find it. I'm gonna figure it out tomorrow. My mom's upset with me that I didn't get it done today. But you know what? I have a headache, which... And I'm really dizzy, which means I think I'm hungry. My stomach is not hungry. But I think the rest of my body is telling me that I need to put something in my system. I wanted to make pasta tonight. It's currently 4.30. I can make some oatmeal now and some pasta later. Or I can make pasta now and oatmeal later. That is the dilemma and that is what's keeping me from making my food right now. Oh, this is horrible lighting. These are my new shoes. They're very light and I love them. Like I love, I love so much. I only wear them to the gym so they're gonna be super clean. I'm never gonna go anywhere else in these cause I wanna keep them looking fresh. But these are them. They're from, I got them from TJ Maxx but they're by Puma. They're the Puma Dare shoes. They're very nice. I really like them. I like that they have no laces because it makes my life a lot easier putting them on. You just like grab this little hooky thing and this hook thing and you just like slip them on. I'm gonna make pasta, I just made my decision. Good for you, Jessica, pat yourself on the back. I'm really bad at making decisions. Pasta in here and I already boiled it so I'm just like doing my thing where I steam it. You guys have seen me do this before. This is hard to do with one hand. I got my falafels warming up in the oven right now. This is the sauce that I use for my pasta, and then I quickly whipped up some cashew cheesy kind of sauce, like an Alfredo type sauce. Um, I'll share the recipe for it. Um, it'll be on the screen or down below, probably down below, but I really like how it came out this time. And it's like nice and like gooey kind of. So I'm gonna add like a significant amount of this. Honestly, finishing off the whole thing. So I added about half of this little container, oh, half of this container of the cheese. Oh my God, I made a mess a little bit, but that's okay. We'll, you know, clean that up. Um, but yeah, it made like, that's quite a bit of sauce, a little bit too much for my liking, but that's okay. So we're gonna do the falafel. So I'm gonna plate it and I will show you in a sec. So this is literally it. <laughs> It's like probably the most pathetic meal I've ever made myself, but, and like least nutritious, I gotta say, I have not been on my nutritional game the past few days. Yesterday, I had two burritos, just like beans and rice and potato burritos from Taco Bell. That's like a lot of shit that I ate yesterday, which is probably why like new things popped up today. So consistency is key. It is really hard, but it really is key. So definitely keep up with your health game if you're on a health game. If you're not, join the health game, you know. It's really hot. It's so good though. This is the pasta that I got. It's the Trader Joe's Organic Brown Light Brown Rice Quinoa Spaghetti Pasta. And they have like other versions of it, like in different shapes, but I just got the spaghetti one because I love spaghetti. That's the only pasta I really like to use. And um I really like it. I'm gonna close my door. Cause my mom watches TV up there so loud as you heard. I want coffee so bad. Like, I'm right in front of my coffee cabinet, and I'm just like, I want you. I asked my little yes or no wheel if I should make coffee or not, and it said yes three times, so. I think I need some coffee. I made my coffee. 
back on the good camera, thank goodness. I have my face mask on. Um, I literally just put it down somewhere over here. Where did I put it? It should be right in front of my face, but it's not. Albert, where did I put the mask? Oh, I put it in the bathroom. This is a Bendonite Clay Aztec Healing Mask. I mixed it with apple cider vinegar. It came out a lot thinner because I put too much apple cider vinegar in the mix. I'm going to go. I'm honestly probably not going to eat anything else today because I'm not hungry. I'm not feeling good. Um, I might do a juice cleanse because I'm just not feeling... Something's off. I don't know if it's the, the, the energy or if it's something else. I don't know. But I'm going to go ahead and edit this video now. And I will see you in my next one. Bye, guys.